there are many fancy pigeon beads are available in the world some of them are big in size colorful and stylish but if you look to see a cute pigeon breeds then oriental field will be your best choice when it comes to show pigeons oriental field pigeons are always among us the top names and this video we will know all standard information about the oriental field pigeon this is an exclusive guide on oriental field pigeons so let's know about the super cute fancy pigeon breed oriental field The Oriental Field Pigeon is a breed of fancy pigeon which was developed over many years ago from selective breeding. It is also known by some other names such as Hankari, Classic Oriental Field, Old Style or Old Fashioned Field. It is called Hankari in its homeland. Meaning of the word Hankari is the bird of Sultan. It is originally a Turkish pigeon breed which is especially breed for the Ottoman sultans in the Manisha Palace, Turkey. In the city of Ottoman, the sultan requested a different breed and breeders started the process. After years of selective breeding at Manisha Palace, they come up with an oriental field pigeon. These birds have a round head, a very small beak, a white tail and beautiful feathers. One look at them and you will understand why the sultan requested this. They have large eyes, a fairly feathery chest, distinct feathers and a small beak that looks as if there is none. The Manisha is an old Ottoman city in the western Turkey. The bed is actually divided into two several color variations and markings, but the blondiness and satiness are the most common variety. The oriental field pigeon was developed from the old fashioned oriental field pigeon and the original form of this bird is still preserved as the old fashioned oriental field. The history of this beautiful pigeon breed reached England and it arrived in the country in 1864. H.P. Caridia is known to have brought it from Izmir. Its name became oriental field then. It made its first appearance in America in 1879 during an exhibition. In Europe, they are classified in the owl family, while they are known as fancy pigeon in the US. Oriental field pigeon appearance Oriental field pigeon is a small sized bird with beautiful appearance. The breed is especially noted for its very short beak and rounded heads. These birds have frill of feathers on their breast. They have a deeper peak crest on the highest point of their head. There are many beautiful color varieties of these birds are available. But the most popular and common color varieties are blondinets and satinets. A satinet is a mostly white bird including the body, face, legs and even the primary flight's feathers. While the blondinets can have another basic color, often blue in those areas. The shoulders, wing covers and tail are then patterned to show a wonderful contrast with the ground color. Average body height of the mature oriental field pigeon is about 33 cm and their average mature body weight is between 310 g to 340 grams. The appearance of an oriental field pigeon depends on its type. But in short, the general appearance of an oriental field pigeon goes like a very small thick beak, a field breast, a crest on its peak, a wide round head, their forehead is arched right from their beak to their crest peak, large eyes, a short, thick but strong neck, a white tail, a broad forward truss breast, short legs covered with grouse muffs short two wings tail just above the ground, well developed tight plumes. From this, you can create a picture in your mind of a proud little bird with thick and close to body feathers, a thick mane, a kobe and compact pack with a round or oval head on top which has large eyes that look at you curiously.
what are oriental field pigeons good for or the uses of oriental field pigeon whether you are into bird keeping or commercial exhibition oriental field should be your best choice this birds has been used for more than 200 years for exhibition due to its beauty even today the pigeons have become part of prominent pigeon exhibitions which are the famous among pigeon lovers as good dresses if you are into pigeon entertainment get yourself an oriental field besides if you want to pet bird for your home which is beautiful and which won't give you a headache by flying away this is your bird can oriental field pigeon fly oriental field pigeons aren't know for their flying skills they can fly but not very long distance their flight is short if you are looking for something like homing pigeons or racing pigeons then these are not for you besides they do not have a great sense of threat so it's better to not fly long distance and become a hawk prey how to identify male and female oriental field pigeon as a beginner you may find it challenging to tell a male oriental field from a female but their behavior gives them away first the male pigeons are happier than the females also the female birds are very calm and gentle while males are little bit angry and keep dancing around males also coo and chase other birds generally females also the male bird has a straight tail if you hold it by wing and shake it in the air the females tail is usually upward last but not least you can check their vent check under their tails for the bones if they are close it is a male bird while a female has bones slightly at a distance to push out the egg telling a male bird from a female is no child's play even the experts can't tell gender correctly sometimes how to take care of oriental field pigeon like racing or homing pigeons these do not require any special attention they don't need a daily practice of flying or training for long hours since they don't fly much distance they make good companions the thing you must be worried about is their feathers the loft or aviary should be free of any wires which may damage your bird's wings Their wings are what makes them so beautiful. So it is a responsibility to keep them intact. Feeding of Oriental field pigeon. You need not follow a dieting regime for your old fields like racing pigeons. These birds are fit to keep their bodies fit. You can give them several nutrition: field seeds, grains, fresh veggies, fruits, corn, and it is same different oriental field pigeon color the satiners and blondiners are not only types of oriental field pigeon they divided further into different color varieties and also there exist other kinds of oriental fields which have been discussed now satiners first one is blueless satiners these are white color birds with a pale pink beak and dark brown eyes their head neck and body are white except their shoulder and wing covers with a deep purple hue each of their wing is laced with a blue color marking the edge distinct they have a dark blue band in the lower region and a dark purple tail with every feather having a white moon spot brunette satinate pigeon these are also white color birds with the only difference being the color of feathers around their neck and on shoulders which is dark red brown the marking is the same as the blueless pigeon blue satinate their shoulders and wing covers are a deep blue with a blue tail and white marks with black in the lower extremity black and downless satinate they differ from blueless satinates only in the terms of their shoulder wing covers and tail colors which are darker usually black or done with darker tail feathers and flight sulfurous satinate oriental field pigeon 
This pigeons have pearl sulfur or white ground color on their shoulders with dark sulfur S feathers. The tail is also dark and the same as blue list. Browner satinate. They have a brown tail with brown lower extremity and pale brown as in dope color shoulders and wing covers. Silver satinate. They come with a grey tail and silver grey shoulder and wing covers. Rest they are the same as blue list color. Now time to know about blondinette's color. Blue list blondinette. They have a blue colored body with red eyes and a blue tail with white moon spots with a small thick black beak. Their body is dark in contrast to their feathers which have white ground. Brownless Bondinette They have a flesh colored care, horn colored beak and acorn brown body and tail. The same as in a blueless blondinette. Silverless Blondinette Their body and tail are silver grey with lacings of the same dark color. Accompanied by flesh colored care, yellow eyes and horn colored beak. Yellowless Blondinette The difference is their soft yellow colored body, tail and shoulder which have a darker yellow colorless. They have yellow eyes with horn colored beaks and flesh colored care. Redless Blondinette Again, their body is the same except for the deeply rich and dark red colored shoulder, wing covered and tail. They have red eyes with horn colored beaks and flesh colored care. Shulfulless Blondinette They have a French grey body and the same tail with deep shulful lacing on a light shulful ground like blueless pigeon. They have yellow gravel eyes, horn colored beaks, flesh colored care and deep golden shulpur head and neck. Apart from this, there are other color variants such as dunless, blacklist, bad browns, bad blues, bad silvers and more. Other than blondiness and satiness, there are some other varieties which are Number 1. Visor These are extremely rare pigeons that look exactly like satinets apart from the fact that their head is a solid color and is clearly separated by marking from around the neck to their chest, making them look beautiful and quite distinct from satinets. The rest of the markings and features are the same as the satinets. Domino These are a little different from visor and satinets. Their neck is completely white and their head is solid colored like a visor. Also, their shields are tails are solid colored and the rest of the body is pure white. They have feather free legs and they come in different color varieties such as silver, blue, black, dun and more. Their eye color and care also differ according to their body color as in blondiness. Turbitans These originated in England and are very popular in many European countries. They are good flyers and are classified as owl pigeons. The distinction that makes them turbitans in the oval shaped spots on their cheeks and forehead. They have dark eyes which differ as per their body color. They are also available in several different color. A special note about oriental field pigeon. The oriental field pigeon is small and sweet bird. It is good for show purpose and also very good for oriental purpose. But it is highly regarded as an affectionate pet that will follow its keeper around. It is not wise to leave these lovely, social and friendly birds alone and isolated. Average lifespan of these pigeon birds can be 7 to 10 years if properly cared. These fancy birds are still raised and breed among fanciers. If you are into pigeon show, several shows are held across the globe. You can witness them and auction during major pigeons event. They also make good birds and if you need a bird companion, bring one home. Their beauty is mesmerizing and they are very low maintenance.
If you like the video, please like and share. Give us your valuable opinion by comment. Subscribe the channel to get the latest update. Be safe and fine until the next video comes.